Alex Christine, an awful situation. Police say the victims were doing everything right just on the road early when someone came in, plowing in at an unreasonable speed, hitting them. Sometimes I just don't know what goes through uh, people's minds. Senseless actions turn lethal in South LA. Two people are dead after a driver evading police caused a multi car crash early Friday morning. Suspect vehicle ran a red light, and as you can see from behind me, the collision was just um, very violent. LAPD says they initially tried to pull over the Cadillac for speeding before it T boned a BMW into a semi. The victims are believed to be a man and a woman in their 30s and haven't been ID'd. I mean, if, if, if you look at the, the, the destruction and devastation behind me, it's just, it, it's very sad. It, you can tell it's very violent, and you just, you just pray for their families. The 21-year-old driver was unhurt and taken into custody along with two other passengers after trying to run away. You're obeying all the traffic laws, you have a green light, and the next thing you know, your, your life ends. Witnesses say one of the suspects purportedly threw a gun onto the roof of one of the buildings here when they were fleeing from police. However, we're still waiting for police to confirm that detail along with some other information, including the suspect's identity. We are told that that suspect will likely face vehicular manslaughter charges. Reporting live in South L.A., Travis Rice, Fox 11 News.